Hi, my name is Jessica. Are you okay? No. Anyway. YouTube star life. My name's Steven. Steven, I got it. And this is Attack. It's not on a snack. Attack. On, on snack. snack. Today we're doing um some. I thought that that bad banana. Okay, so apparently Mexican people woke up one day. And decided that they could interpret a peanut to be like a Japanese peanut. Those fools. Part of Mexico title, original Japanese peanuts. They decided what the original Japanese peanuts was. I don't know if Japanese people know that this happened, but we're gonna find out what these actually are. They're the fucking are. balls of peanuts and they fucking They sort of shots. look like Spanish peanuts, but that doesn't make any sense. They could just be like candy coated. So it's a I don't know. Mexican take on the original Japanese peanut. Right. But Japanese people don't have like a long history of tree doing peanuts. It? It's supposed to be cherry blossoms. And then the other one, Malo Bisque, product of Turkey. I think this is gonna be good. It's a cookie covered in chocolate filled with caramel and marshmallow. Does that sound bad? It's not the noise of uh, moon pie. Looks like it a moon does pie. look like a moon pie, but a moon pie <coughs> has a cake in it. This one apparently is a cookie. It better be good or I'm going to be upset. Should be. So if you're a vegan, uh, yeah. yeah, basically, and you ran out of, you no longer are allowed to have bacon, you could substitute these spooky maple rice chips. Could you? Wow. To fill in that bacon gap. So we're going to see if this is a stopgap measure for a lack of bacon in our lives. Just eat bacon. It's not that hard. It's not. It doesn't have any meat flopped on it in any way. It's just, yeah, Sorry, I'll take that out. just <laughs> smoky maple, as if maple trees were regularly smoked and then thrown on a chip. What do? All right. This is the question of the decade. What do Mexicans think Japanese nuts taste like? Any suggestive innuendo you want to infer there is welcome. Hey, what are you trying to do? I know. What are you trying to do? It smells do? pretty fun. Get in there. Get... Mm. It's covered in uh, something. Fun. Holy shit, what's happening? <laughs> Reminds me of uh, wasabi balls without the wasabi. I thought this was a candy coated peanut. I'm a little bit let down. It's like a. Somebody took a peanut and ground it down into a paste and then made a crunchy... A shell? Is there something in, like the fruit inside? What's, There's why no is there, fruit. Why is there fruit on top? It's, it's a trick. See, it's the empty... I'm trying to crack one open and see... It's empty. No, it has peanut in it. Mine doesn't have peanut in it. You got ripped off. Apparently some of them don't have it's peanut It's a peanut with peanut coating? What, what, are they they, what are the Mexicans thinking? It's a little bit sweet, a little bit salty. Is there any other flavor besides like... A little bit of peanut. Is there like a spicy? There's just spicy, but is there any like flavor? Does it taste like anything but a little bit spicy peanut? This one looks like a butt. Alright. What the best part about this for me is? It's ball shaped. <laughs> kind of like balls. Alright. If you know why Mexicans decided these were Japanese peanuts, please. Please let us know in the comments, because I have no idea. No idea. I saw these, I was like, that doesn't even make any sense. What is going on? Um, I, I don't know if they're actually better than just salted peanuts. They might be worse than just salted peanuts. So, five, average. They're okay. They weren't bad. Yeah, I get it. They're not... <clears throat> we should call them and ask them. Moving on. Oh my Jesus. Get in there. Ugh. Whoa! God! It's like a pancake. The worst kind of pancake. Now give it back. God! What were you expecting? It reminds me of high school or something. <laughs> what? But like you get those like square of French toast that they like. Oh toast, yeah. And they give you like, and they have like fake maple flavoring on the exterior of that, and they so ground it in fake. Does that traumatize you as a yes. kid? Yes. Just like I wanted breakfast, and instead I got this like <laughs> slurry of sugar and like. A loose, spongy carbohydrate. Did you? This is what that smells like. It reminds me of wanting to kill myself a little bit too. Okay. It's 
smell hickory. I don't smell any hickory. I just smell like fake ass maple flavor. Ready? Alright. I really like that the whole thing is really textury because they use like full grain to make the chips. I'll try to take pictures of the chips later. You can see them on the vlog. It's really textury. Apparently, there's actual maple syrup in here. That's good. And apparently, there's no fake maple syrup. What the fuck? The smell bad. The smell just makes me want to run away and hide. It's just you're searching with high school and uh, <laughs> that high that school was in the time. Like the reminds me of Martinsburg High School fucking cafeteria. Oh hell no! I know, yeah, <laughs> basically. Uh, but these are good. They're pretty good. They're a little greasier than usual. I feel like maybe I'm crazy. I like that they're they reminds you. They're a fucking cracker basically. You get hints of like bacon. Sometimes because of smoke. Does it substitute for bacon? Fucking no, nothing does. If you saw this on the streets, you should try it. I give it seven. It's the Lundberg rice chip smoky maple flavor. Seven for me. Six. Uh, because it reminds me of high school. Oh, hell no! Fuck this shit! Next product. So this is a Sare, S A R A Y brand Malibus product of turkey. If it's not delicious, I'm gonna fight someone. It better taste like turkey. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Steven. Oh my god. Steven. I don't know. Put, put them down. Just put them down. Just say do it. Whoa. Whoa. They're double stacked. Double stacked. Wah, wah, wah. Look at this shit. You see it. Where's the turkey meat? Does it smell like? Does it smell okay? It was like dark chocolate. Yeah, it doesn't even smell like milk chocolate. They actually paid to put something more cacao, cacao, cacao in it. I'm going in. Ooh. The caramel center is not really caramel. It's just like clear jelly of some kind. Look at what it. Is it is a caramel. Look at it. It's clear. It's not really caramel. I don't even have it's like mine's just a hole. It's like a honey. Oh <laughs> kidney. These are good though. I mean moon pies. What do you mean? The marshmallow the and the crumb crumblies. That's a cake though. It's not a cake, it's a crumbly. Whatever. I thought it was a cake. No. It's actually like a cookie. It's like, like a thing. biscuit, yeah, a cookie. Oh shit. This is a moon pie then. It's like a combination of moon pies and Girl Scout cookies, which is good, I think. How much was it? A dollar. A dollar? Shit. But it's only for like, if you thought you were getting like a ton, you're only getting six fucking cookies. Those are decent sized cookies. I mean, they're double stacked for crying out. No. Oh. Okay. I do think the exterior, because it's a darker chocolate, is better. And Dark chocolate is amazing. Look at these suckers. Eight! An eight? Yeah, those Jesus are amazing. Fuck. I can eat all of those. Um, I think they're too sweet for an eight. But I'm not like a bitch. Hey, give me a glass of milk and no, I'm going to have a party tonight. Sorry. Are you? They're really good. Personal preference wise, I wouldn't normally have a cookie candy thing. I'm gonna categorize it as cookie. I'm gonna look at you. I'm gonna categorize it as cookie for the purpose of the blog, but it's too sweet to be a normal cookie for me. I would, uh, seven. Put it, um, mallow bisque. Or, I you or, got or, the Asian. Nope. Or <coughs> go, uh, go buy some milk from a Girl Scout. Find a Girl Scout. Buy it or punch her and take it. Doesn't Murder. Her. Uh, we don't want to. Barrier in the back as usual. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's an option. Put that as option B. A would be. Fun. A is first. That's what I was. Right. <laughs> We've tried uh, three interesting snacks today. We recommend the Malabisque, the rice chips. Strangely, 
Not a valid substitute for bacon, but pretty good. Uh, skip the weird Mexican-Japanese uh, peanuts. Get that noise out of here. I don't know what's going on there. It's just weird peanuts. Make sure you please hit subscribe and visit us at our blog at attackonsnack.com to see all the reviews we've done before. Um, and it's a better way to sort through the different categories of snacks to see if you kind of are interested in a particular thing. If you have anything you would like us to review, please put it in the comment below. We'll check and we'll try to make that happen. So you can see what we think about your favorite weird or international snacks. Alright, thanks. Bye. Bye.